look at that, a golden jellyfish. I've always wanted to touch a jellyfish, not to mention swimming with so many of them. How is he not getting hurt even after touching them? Simple. These little fellas don't have stinking tentacles. If they are hungry, they only need to swim towards the light and make some food. They have some algae inside their jelly bodies that undergo photosynthesis. Ah, yes. Plants somehow manage to be behind everything. Come on, I'll show you what this process is all about. Green plants are the living organisms that can prepare their own food. They absorb water from the roots, which is transported upwards to the leaves. The leaves also absorb light and carbon dioxide. The water also enters the leaves and they react to form food. Oxygen is released in the process. So the process by which plants utilize water, carbon dioxide and sunlight to prepare food is called photosynthesis. Only green parts of the plant can synthesize their own food because in their cells we find chloroplasts which contain the pigment chlorophyll. The chlorophyll in the chloroplast is capable of absorbing sunlight which can be used in synthesizing food. Leaves are the parts where maximum photosynthesis occurs and so they are generally called the kitchen of the plant. Let us summarize. Photosynthesis is the process used by plants, algae and certain bacteria to harness energy from sunlight and turn it into chemical energy.